Well, hello everyone. It's uh, time for another vlog. And in response to a recent comment of, uh, I thought those one-shot wonders were good, were a good idea. I quite liked them. I thought I'd do another one. Just for you, Bob. So, I wonder where I am. Any guesses? Yeah, a little bit shaky on the old uh, camera here, aren't I? Anyway, must be lack of lack of practice. So, I wonder where I am. Well, I am one shot wandering at the Collie River, not far from uh, the Buckingham Hall, which is, uh, well, deserted, abandoned, whatever you want to call it. And it's just up the river there. And it's uh, where we're camped, right next to the water, which is very nice. And uh, I've been wandering around to see what I could find today for um, today's photographic assignment. So anyway, here we are, One Shot Wonder. This is the old crossing and you can see the road goes ahead there. I'm set up just down there and the road bridge is just there. If I spin around over here, wait for that car to go past, you can probably see what I was looking at and if I zoom in a little bit this old gnarly tree in amongst all those nice straight gum trees in the background so I've taken some shots of that just earlier and uh, we'll see how they come up And now it's just a waiting game. A little bit 20 minutes till sunset. And uh, I came early to make sure I could find a composition. I was down here the other day, but it was bright sunlight. And I thought it might be good, but I didn't think it would be this good. Anyway. Right, so the colours are starting to come in as you can see here. So we're going to grab a, a shot or two as the uh, cloud lights up a little bit. Bracketed shot as you can see. One stop over, one stop under and it's making the middle two second timer. Dirty screen. <laughs> on the camera, that's what happens when you put your face up to it. Anyway, so there's the uh, underexposed, normal, and over. Put those together, and we should get something that is uh, processable to get what we're looking at. And the sky getting a deeper colour over there as the sun slips below the horizon. And as the uh, flies have disappeared and the view becomes better, of course the mozzies come out, don't they? And being next to this uh, waterway, it's not surprising. Look at the texture in that. Wow. 
Should have had another composition, shouldn't I, down here? Actually, I have, do have one on the way back, but it's probably going to be gone by the time I get there. Okay, so I've hurried back to my uh, other composition, which was this beautiful tree. And some little ones behind it. And I really like this bark on the ground. But it's, uh, it's a six second exposure. Um, I'm not exactly sure I like that composition either, so um, it might be one for in the morning. I might have to. Oh, I'm puffing because I ran. That's not easy when you're carrying a camera. Alright, so we'll take one anyway. What the heck? What's the worst that's going to happen? We get a good photo. You just don't know, do you? So we'll just. And the mozzies are out to play now. Focus the best we can. I can see it's going to be grainy because of the um, lack of light. So six seconds on f11 at us ISO 100, which is probably not ideal. And let's just see what auto ISO says it should be. Uh, well, let's say 125, so it's not. We'll do that one as well. Six seconds. Yeah, well, we'll see what it comes out like. As the light fades just in case I don't get to uh, do this in the morning um, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog and uh, a little look around Collie River and uh, if you do like what we're uh, what we've done give us a thumbs up give us a like we'd highly appreciate that and we'd e highly appreciate it even more if you uh, followed the channel and uh, of course if you do that please don't forget to hit that notification bell so you know when we upload the next video so we'll see I might see you in the morning, I might not, you never know. I'll at least come and have a look and see what the light's like. Okay, see you later, bye.